Nothing to do with then that. Then why? Just get out. I don't For want what? you here. Then okay, then leave You're not allowed Hey, what's going on, guys? Shot Clips here once again. And today's some crazy clips of the worst cheaters I can find. And like always, guys, my favorite clip will be at the end. But in this first one, it is pretty insane. This man goes wild after finding out his girl cheated on him. I lied to you. You said what? Yeah, I did it, and I lied to you. And I can't say that it was an accident. But I regret it. Yes, I did. I regret it. <laughs> Now the reality is guys, this is not gonna be the first or last person this ever happens to, and this is not the first time I ever heard this excuse. But the best thing he could possibly do is just move on because if he stays in this relationship, the pain will only get worse. So he came home and he was like, you know, babe, I lost my job. I'm like, all right, cool. So a month later, like the bills, it was time for the bills or whatever. You know, and I'm like, you know, the bills do, babe, or whatever. And he was like, okay, you know, I'm not working. And, and I'm just, in a month, like it's all kind of hustles. You could have been doing something. Or whatever. So I told him, I said, look, if I pay these bills, are you going to pay me the money back? This man had the nerve to tell me, why should I pay my wife back for, for paying our bills? I told this man from day one, my money is my money. And his money is our money. Why should I spend my money paying the bills? Like, no, he should have paid me back. I'm going to pause the video right here because she just says something completely wild. Now, I'm not sure if you guys know how marriage works, but usually the priest will say you two are now one, which means both your incomes are now one. Everything you guys do and own is now one. You're not two separate people anymore. So if this woman really wants to be on her own and be by herself with her own money, then don't get in a relationship or be married. But let's continue on with the clip. So that's when I decided, like, I can't be with this man no more. So... I had sex with his homeboy. Like, we all cool. I sex his homeboy or whatever. You know, we went together. We, we got, we left. We, I met up with him. And we was, you know, we was chill. We was chilling. We were drinking or whatever. And I started venting. I started venting. You know, like, I started getting emotional. One thing led to the next. I did not purposely mean to do what I did with his friend. But things happen. Things happen. Like, y'all understand what I'm going through. So... You know, his friend ended up giving me some money or whatever. And he was like, you know, babe, look, don't worry about it. Do handle whatever you got to handle. Like, his friend was every single thing I desire in a man. Like, everything I desire in a man. And, you know, ain't nobody trying to hear my side. Ain't nobody trying to hear This woman is not taking any accountability for her actions. And she just cheated all because her husband went broke. And to be honest, guys, this happens quite often. It completely blows my mind how she doesn't see how she is in the wrong using her emotions as an excuse saying oh things just happened i was emotional no you're a horrible human being and you deserve all the current hate you're getting on the internet hey man what you man i'm okay man no what's your problem it's so what are you gonna say you heard 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 the crazy part about this clip is only the dog will forever know the truth. If he just barked even a bit, everything would have been uncovered. If you're gonna be stupid, you better be tough. You let him hit it raw. You didn't have second thoughts. Now you're a single mom. And this is exactly why there are just so many single mothers out there. Simply because these women do not know how to pick men to sleep with. And they're letting anyone hit. You hate most about your ex. She left me for no reason. Real shit. She was with a, with, a, with a black dude the next day. <laughs> so, like, so there was a reason. Oh, damn, thinking about it now, yeah. That so, was the reason, man. Do you know this guy? No, he was a street dude, for real, though. So I ain't even really get close to that. You know, I ain't even want to know because, you know. She left you for the streets? <laughs> like, literally, bro. Real shit. Hey. hey. Um, Shout out to Hi, Mia. Instagram. Coco. Thank you very Bars. much. Why? Disrespectful people. You know? How did you, like, find out that she was with another dude the next day? I saw a post from my boy. And they were together. Not oh. my boy, my boy. But, like, one of my friends yeah. posted it. And I saw that shit. I was like, damn. Already? Like, it wasn't even a day, really. So That's wild. How'd that make you feel? I wasn't even really sad, man. I was just, you know, how long on to you, the next. How long were you two together? A good eight months. And did you, like, really, like, 
awkward or was it like to be honest my ex was back in eighth grade i ain't even had a girl since so I, not really i never even yeah guys if someone ever breaks up with you this means man or woman and they immediately start dating somebody else that person has been in the picture for quite some time and that's not their rebound that was the better option in their head they lost feelings for you a long time ago and yes they were cheating on you the entire time this woman left this man for the streets and i guess she just took out the trash herself it's crazy how men really fail like telling us that we're gonna end up alone forever is an insult <laughs> Y'all really think that that's an insult for us? That's, at this point, that's what we want. Women will say that they don't want any man. However, will still go to the nightclub, seeking men validation, post pictures of themselves, seeking men's validation, buying makeup, buying dresses to please men. Who are you lying to? This is the worst excuse you've given to end a relationship or a situation ship. It wasn't an excuse. I just liked his friend better. So you told him that you liked his friend? Yes. How did he take that? He cried. Do you feel bad? <laughs> and this is exactly why so many men just do not want to date anymore simply because they have a woman like this in their past that completely shattered them who wants to deal with relationships when you could just focus on yourself and be happy damn shoddy what's oh never mind you fucking pregnant my bad <laughs> I really hope this is not a trend and this is just some kind of joke. This is disgusting. And she thinks it's funny. You serious? Who is this guy? Bro, who is this guy? <laughs> <laughs> now we're saying pretty much every video long distance relationships do not work especially if someone's going to college Ooh, you forgot to turn that location off honey forgot to turn that location off did you no you forgot to turn that location off no oh you forgot to turn that location off no who is i don't follow you we share location i don't follow you we share location we share location you ain't got nothing for me you ain't got nothing for me you ain't got nothing yeah i do i brought you to get and your do. nails done but and you ain't do. had no being the following don't put your camera in my face girl, put my camera don't put your camera in my face i put my camera yeah, in my face location baby learn to turn those locations off learn to turn those locations off girl don't be doing that's what y'all do don't be doing that shit 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 don't be if you gonna cheat, turn your location off. Now this is where the stereotype that men are so bad at cheating comes from because who the hell leaves a location on while cheating? Why would you ever do this, especially at a nail salon? Come on, bro. Everyone thinks men cheat more often. No, we don't. We just get caught more often. Women are just so much better at hiding it. My girlfriend thinking I came to the family vacation for her. <laughs> You slept with my best friend? Yes, I was thinking about you the whole time. <laughs> Come on now, dog. Is it me or is thinking of someone while doing the act way worse? Like that's not helping her argument. I'm sorry, I just wanna make sure I'm getting this right. Y'all are painting the color of your man's tip on your fingernails and then telling people about it. Mm. Okay. I haven't seen this trend yet and I really hope I never see this trend. Where is she getting this from? Hey, hi, I'm Sarah, what's your name? Idra. I'm Dylan Stark's girlfriend. Me too. <laughs> in my honest opinion, if a man is juggling two relationships, he is probably a bum. What are you doing with this many women in your life? Go find a job and work, bro. A six-year-old Colorado Springs boy has been suspended from school for alleged sexual harassment. I was doing class here. Yeah. We were doing a um, reading group, and I mean, no one kissed her on the hand. That's what happened. He kissed her hand. Hunter's mom now asking that the incident be removed from his record, calling the punishment extreme. The school district saying the incident fits its description of sexual harassment they say it will stay on hunter's record as long as he is in the school district so his mom didn't say it in this interview but in a different interview she said they're boyfriend and girlfriend like they're official this isn't just, this isn't just some random girl this little boy is going up to and smooching is this what feminism has gotten us is this what political correctness and leftism has gotten us? this is completely crazy and this is what feminism has done to society and to be honest this kid is just a victim of it and he has no idea kids are just being kids and Everyone in this generation is suddenly a snowflake. Get out. Literally why? get out. Why? I don't who's, want you here. Who's in here? Man, it has nothing to do with then that. Then why? Just get out. I don't For want what? you here. Well, then okay, then leave. You're not then. allowed to be here no who's more. Who's in here? There's literally No, but at least stop. Get out. <laughs> Please. 
Wish there was more backstory about this clip, but this is all I really had. I guess he ended up finding something he just didn't like. But that does wrap it up, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys do more content just like this, please watch the videos you guys see at the top of the screen. It does help my channel a lot. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace.